What's up, guys? It's Jeff from the Infirm Report. Today, we're talking about Zach Cozart, the shortstop for the Cincinnati Reds who's recovering from a knee injury. We're going to break down that injury with the fantasy doctor, Dr. Seelan Preck, and also talk about the fantasy implications with the People's Pen, Andy Singleton. Guys? Zach Cozart, shortstop for the Reds, had his knee rebuilt and reconstructed back in June of last year when he tore them while running to first base. Now this is a long recovery with about 9 to 11 month return to play timeline. So look for him to be back early in the year, but look for him to have a slow start, both on the offensive side and defensive side. Over time, look for him to be better and better with regards to that knee. Before suffering that gruesome injury, Cozart was on pace for a career season in 2015. Now despite him never truly living up to his potential, he did remain a starting shortstop in Major League Baseball. And upon his return, which should be as early as opening day, he will go back to being the Reds starting shortstop. Doesn't necessarily make him somebody to target outside of deeper leagues, but somebody to certainly monitor because he might be a fill-in replacement if somebody else on your team goes down. I'm really more surprised than anything that Jose Peraza doesn't get more mention as being given an opportunity to return to shortstop, considering the only reason he moved off the position was because he was blocked in the Brave system by Angleton Simmons, both of whom are now gone. Uh, he's moved to second base in outfield, which is where you hear talks about him, but he really did come up as a shortstop. So I wouldn't be surprised if the Reds, who are kind of in rebuilding mode now, uh, would possibly open up the door and give him another opportunity there. So if I were to take a, a flyer on anybody from the Reds, uh, it wouldn't be Cozart, and it wouldn't be Ayuhengo Suarez, who's gonna be playing third base for them. Uh, Peraza would be my guy to target, but definitely keep an eye on Cozart anyway, just because he will start the season as that starter.